Okay, the offering is done. If you like, you can come closer to take picture of the offering. On those family weavings right here. Let's yes. See where those I'm, are let me ceremonial see if pieces I can get the... from the Kero communities. Kero. <laughs> they like it. The Kero is a community which was only rediscovered, we can say, by 1940. They used to be hiding. They live far away, far away from the mountain. You know, we have a very special place. It's called the Koyoriti Mountain, the Apu Koyoriti. Very special place where we have a pilgrimage once a year. And especially the Kairos, they go there. So once in the 40s, an anthropologist noticed a community with a special clothing. You know, you can see the clothing is a little bit different. You know, the hats and the textiles. And he started to follow them. And they found that, you know, they don't live near to Cusco. They live far away. So they've been hiding. So they don't have much contact with the, with the people of the cities. But still, there is some syncretism with the Catholic religion, but the textiles and the clothing is more authentic than in other places. They are considered the, the keepers of the Inca tradition. Mm -hmm. Where are they, north or south or west? Uh, in what direction is ahorita Ausangati? Pero la comunidad por acá, no? No. The... Más cerca de... Carro va por ahí, pero da la vuelta, sí. Sí, sí. No, o, no será, no hay que ¿No? No, está es cerca, o con gato. O con gato, ¿no? Sí. Yeah, it is on this direction. The car goes far away in that way and then has to go around. O con gato is on this direction. So that will be south. O con gato, a usan gato. Coyurite. 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 On this, each line on this, these family weavings, aren't they done at certain times of the day in different hours by children or family members in that each line may be a different year or a different day or week? Each of these textiles are like books, pics about the family, about the occasion when it was made, what kind of purpose, even, it's not even only the symbols there. It's also when you start, because it's hand spin, hand spin, you say? Right, and the loom. So, yes, spinning, spinning normally goes in one direction to the right, but when it goes to the left, it's for spiritual purposes, those we call the yoke, to stop the energies we don't want, to keep away. So. There is something in the piece of textile that's very important. Something you don't see and something you don't see. You see and some you don't, okay? But when we talk about all these symbols, we are talking about our joy, our thank you, the, our gratitude to the plants, to the mountains, to the apples, to the lakes. Also, we can see from the other side, you know? When we talk, the spirit, the apples is speaking. We can talk about the Milky Way, the two pieces, the feminine, the masculine. We can talk about the fields, the cultural aspects, this reality, or the three realities. You know, there's a lot of information in this piece of, piece of textile. In some communities, you know, where they work more with the, with the llamas, alpacas, they have different designs, beautiful designs. Some others where they connect very much with the contour, they have symbols of the condor flying in different ways. Huh? Some is arriving, some is, you know, just soaring. It's a beautiful expression. For us, one of the most precious, the most special gift is a text. Because, you know, when we receive a baby, we receive in a text. There is a lot of information there. Like the one you are watching right now, it has to do with the cochas, the lakes. Huh? And the lakes are the, the bird places, the, the, like the womb of the mothers. Ah. And it has to do also some other symbols there with the stars. Now, 
isn't this a more modern piece because of the coloring of the dye? Because this dye here is more bright than this. This is much more older. The other one must be something like 40 or 50 years old. Right, because the coloring of the dye. This was when they started becoming more synthetic and using Synthetica. Yes, that's right. The old ones, it was natural dyes, but in 1940s, it was brought the aniline dyes. Right. And they start to change very much. All the colors start to run and... But it's still beautiful, but you know, it's much more beautiful than natural. Yeah, the natural is beautiful. And our friends, they also brought some of their textiles from their family for to sell. If you want to purchase at the end, show us. Manabendev, no? Sure. Yeah.